Welcome to Adventures with Captain Ray Kelly. This adventure will be part two of my fishing trip to Peanut Island. But it was cut short with an emergency and I had to go to the emergency room. I'll be fishing on my boat, Adventures, and I'd do a little trolling in the Lake Worth Lagoon. My plan was to fly drones at Peanut Island but first I wanted to try to catch a barracuda. Welcome to Adventures with Captain Ray Kelly. I'm here on my boat, right now, and we're going fishing. I got one rod out, I'm just trolling right in the marina as we go out. But we're gonna head down to uh, a spot that holds barracuda. Hopefully, uh, I'll get one, I'll get something, but uh, we'll see. So come on along. On part one, I caught this nice Jack Ravel, which broke my rod. me a rod, <laughs> but I got him. It's a nice one. So we're going to release it. Um, so now let's head out to the barracuda spot and uh, see if I can get a barracuda on the, the heavier rod and then we'll go fly there to us at Peanut Island. Please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel now. And if you hit the little bell, you'll be notified of our newly released videos. That's the old branch right there. It's a nice fishing gear now. There's a storm right beyond those condos. Yeah, you got to keep an eye on it. Barracuda spot. Well, I hate to say it, but it looks like the uh, the storm is uh, moving south, southeast actually. So I definitely got to keep an eye on it. But what's nice about Peanut Island is they have a uh, day dock, and it's right there. So you can go in there, which I've done in the past when the storm rolls through, and you tie up and you're in safe harbor. So we'll keep an eye on it. We'll see what happens. Right there. And we got this guy trying to pass us on the right. got this guy I can hear. So we got to keep an eye on him. All right, what I said, I'm going to let him pass right here because we're going to start trolling. So, but uh, this guy likes cutting it close. And anyway, there it is right there. See how busy it is? And that's the water taxi. It takes you to Peanut Island. Yeah, so, but it's a great place to boat and kayak and to fish and to fly drones. So we're going to set out the uh, barracuda rod and see if we get lucky. All right, 
right anyway. We're hooked up. That wasn't out. 30 seconds to take a line. Anyway, hopefully it's a barracuda. But we're gonna see. We will see. Still take a line. Still take a line. Whatever it is, it's big. Take a line. Take a line. Alright, so anyway, we're hooked up. We're hooked up. Wasn't that one minute? And I'm hooked up. And this is a heavy rod. This is a heavy rod, folks. Man, it's still taking line. It's still taking line. All right. I got heavy test on here. So anyway, we're gonna get it back. We'll get it back, but it could be a shark. Not only a barracuda, it could be a shark. We'll see, but the key is you got to keep pressure on it. Got to keep pressure on it, and then you can't keep too much pressure on it. I mean, I didn't even get a chance to put the, the phone, the camera, on a tripod. Anyway, we're going to give it our best shot at landing it. But we're getting a little back. We're getting it back. Let me know in the comments if you think I'm going to land this fish. So I don't know what it is. I really don't. Probably a big barracuda though. This one. <laughs> it's like the other one. Yeah. This is, I would think it's a shark. That's what my guess is. No, 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 it's a barracuda. It's a barracuda. But look at the size of it. It's got to be four feet long. Yep. Four feet long. But it gave me a nice fight, let me tell you. So, now I got to try to get it in the boat. But anyway, it's a, it's a It's not a king. It's a barracuda. And uh, I'm trying to uh, keep pressure on it. But that's a... Uh, a four foot barracuda. Yeah, so we'll see if I can get it.
got it. I got it in the boat, but I got the god darn hook implanted in my my thumb. Yeah, it hurts. So the fish is down here in the boat, but I got a, a medical emergency and god darn it hurts. Yeah, so anyway, now I gotta figure this out because it's got a barb on it and uh, I don't know. We'll figure this out. I'll figure something out. This is uh, crazy, crazy. Because that is in there too. Down deep, down deep, no copy. I don't know. Uh, I haven't figured this out, so we're going to have to figure something out. I'll be back. All right, first things first is I released the Barracuda, but now the storm has rolled in. So I'm going into that safe harbor, and I'm going to tie up, and I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do with this guy Don Hook. But I have a feeling I may have to go back with the hook in there. And as long as I don't put put pressure on it, I'll be all right. But it's pouring now, folks. It's pouring out. So we're gonna get into safe harbor and uh, take shelter. But thanks for watching, and I'll let you know what happens. All right, so anyway, I'm heading back, heading back to my dock. The rainstorm passed, and I should be back at my dock in uh, eight to ten minutes. And then I think I'm going to go to the emergency room. I went to Palm Beach Gardens Medical Center, and they were great there. Dr. Cabrera removed the hook. Dr. Cabrera numbed my thumb, and then he snipped the hook, cut it right off. And I might add, it was deeply embedded in my thumb. Dr. Cabrera was great. Thank you, Dr. Cabrera. Thank you to my nurse, Melissa, and all the staff at Palm Beach Gardens Medical Center. And here's a great tip. Don't grab the fishing lure when you're lifting a big fish into the boat. And as always, thanks for watching.